I'm Dwayne Ross of Servants United Parish. I will be leading daily devotions with you. The basis for these daily devotions is from Christ in Her Home, a daily devotional series. The Bible readings are from the Revised Standard Version. The reading for Friday, May 1st, is found in 2 Corinthians verse or chapter 4, verses 1 through 6. Therefore, having this ministry by the, by the mercy of God, we do not lose heart. We have renounced disgraceful, underhanded ways. We refuse to practice cunning or to tamper with God's word. But by the open statement of the truth, we would commend ourselves to every man's conscience in the sight of God. And even if our gospel is veiled, it is veiled only to those who are perishing. In their case, the God of this world has binded the minds of the unbelievers to keep them from seeing the light of the gospel of, of the glory of God, Christ, who is the likeness of God. For what we preach is not ourselves, but Jesus Christ as Lord, with ourselves as your servants for Jesus' sake. For it is the God who said, Let light shine out of darkness, who has shown in our hearts to give lights of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Christ. The word of the Lord. Philip and James, apostles. We do not lose heart. Verse 1. My grandfather died suddenly of a heart attack the year before I was born. I wish I had known him. By God's mercy, he came to faith amid hardship as a sailor in World War II. Following the war, he became a faithful church member. As Philip and James, apostles remembered today, passed the faith on to others. So my grandfather gladly raised my mother in the faith. Though there are high moments in faith, as Christians, we believe that faith is fundamentally a we endeavor. Together, we do not lose heart. Together, we renounce the harmful things of the world. Together, we proclaim not ourselves, but Jesus Christ. I will not see my grandfather face to face in this life. But when I gather with fellow Christians in worship, I see a room full of faithful faces. In this faith, hearing the word of God, Praying for the world, exchanging peace, and sharing the meal of Jesus, I share, by God's mercy, in the faith of my grandfather. Let us pray. God of mercy, ignite my heart in love for you, the world, and the church, through Christ. Amen. Please join me in the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen.